Stafford. We are jumping in here at Stafford. We're back in the Street Stock Series fixed. Uh, Class C Series, so there are cautions. 50 laps. We are the number three. Hopefully it's a clean one. Uh, I'm just leaving this all default, I think. We'll see if we can qualify. Only 10 cars in here. But uh, Stafford, really, really awesome, fun short track, but one that I'm not ever very fast at. We'll hopefully be able to finish top half of the field here with the uh, top five. Only 10 cars here. Could be a caution fest, though. This thing is so floaty with no grip through the center of the corner there as I try to get a run and nearly spin out. This first lap's not going to be any good. Best I could do was a point three in practice. Point, like, three five. So we'll see if we can replicate something like that here on the second lap. The thing just floats so much, and the rear end wants to kick out. One more lap. It's so hard to keep it stable. So we could end up getting some cautions. Try and get back on throttle quickly. Better exit that time. We just ran a .46, which isn't great, but this is looking better. Get a little bit smoother through three and four here. Not a good exit, but should improve our time. 3.06. There's the flag, man. That's good enough for P4 at the moment, but uh, that's all right. Top side could be pretty tough. Um, as long as we can keep it out of the wall and not have anybody overdrive entry on our inside and hit us, should be all right. Riley said good luck before qualifying, so good luck to him as well. And I don't recognize anybody else, so... But hopefully it's a clean one. Looking to have a clean one here. Probably going to release this tonight. It's Tuesday, or it's a Wednesday night. I usually record two on Monday and release them Tuesday, Thursday, because I don't really have much time in the week these days. But I just barely got a window in to race this, what should be a shortish race. I'm going to try and release that tonight. See me almost spin out there. But yeah. Wanted to get a Stafford race in. Uh, the uh, late model stocks, which I think what Nick ran here earlier this week, they look pretty fun. But I uh, figured I'd try these. I don't think I'd been any good here in the late model stocks with how much grip they have. But I don't know if I'll be any good with this either. We'll have to see. If we can keep from spinning out, and depending on how the cautions fall, hopefully this will be just all green 50 laps. Be really interesting to see how the tires play out. Unfortunately, we are waiting on the five car, who is not doing anything, just making us wait. Could get to the grid, but not able to until he finishes up or hits the button. We'll see how this goes. Turn one, especially on a restart, can be really, really treacherous. You get a lot of people diving it in, sliding. Especially with these cars, they're so floaty. You can see all kinds of nasty stuff. I think I've run this combo before and I just have seen people full throttle into turn one on a restart and wipe out the entire field. Pretty sure I remember that happening at some point. <laughs> we'll see. Keeping that all the same. We are starting P4. And uh, we'll try and hang on to that outside for the first couple laps and see if we can all right, man. get some green right flag laps and get strung road. out. Maybe You're have us close. a good We've race. Try and keep it nice and right. smooth without sliding too much. Keep the heat out of it. Estimated SOF is 2,759. 2,700 strength of field. We expect to be fighting for the podium. That's pretty good strength of field for uh, for not that many cars. Let's see, I got the 
thing here, I can see who's got the lowest I rating. Oh, the... Ten cars got a 763, but we got four people uh, at 4,900 or above, so it's top-heavy. And then we got eight car all the way up or above average I rating, which is pretty cool. Don't expect that all the time. And I hope this will be a clean one. We'll have to see. Can be a mess sometimes. Slinger was a mess, but honestly, it wasn't as bad as it could have been for that track and how tight it is. I feel like that was a better race than maybe I was expecting because we had that green run at the beginning for a little while and then we started getting some cautions after that. But it could have just been that from the start. So I guess we're lucky that it wasn't. Trying to get something situated down here real quick. All right. No extra tires, so no reason to pit, of course. And of course, on these starts and restarts, gotta watch out with the shifting. Can't miss a shift. Well, we definitely can miss a shift, but you definitely don't want to but very well within our capabilities. <laughs> Haven't decided if I'm gonna run uh, NIS tomorrow night. I just really do not like the new Atlanta. <laughs> we will see if I decide to do that or not. All right, man, we're going green next time, bye. I can't believe they're doing it new Atlanta right after Daytona really stinks <laughs> now that New Atlanta is such a bad track two plate tracks in a row not very fun but I may end up doing it Get ready. probably won't have anything better to do Everyone. we're coming to the green though here at Stafford hopefully fall in behind the two we'll, we'll see once we get out of green, green, green turn two, but we just got a not very good start. We'll have to fall in behind the six car if we don't spin out. Six car got a great start there. Be nice and smooth. This is probably not a bad spot to be in either, because if we get a caution, we'll be on the inside for the restart. See everyone throwing it in hard. You can really overdrive these things. I'm just trying not to push it too hard. It's probably going to make it get tight through the center like I just kind of experienced. Bad exit there. we got a little gap to the 8 though. Just try and clip that, yep, that white line just barely on entry and kind of let it drift up a bit but not too much. Six car might just be quicker than us anyway. We're still in top five spot. Running green so far. A lot of race left. Let's not run anybody over. Pretty much nose to tail first all the way back to me. Four cars going to look for a pass and make contact. Outside. That sends Fire the six up, up the track a little bit. He's going to get me we cleared again. Good. I'm not going to throw it in. He just checked up for that wreck. He's most likely quicker than I am. They save it. Making that, trying to make that pass and uh, we stay green here. But checking up for that has let the two behind us catch up just a little bit. Careful on that throttle out of the corner. 
the two car up front is really liking what he's seen in the mirror with that contact and then this close battle he's just checking out from us all back here We're hanging with them, I just can't really get a run to do anything. Unless I do that, that was bad. Looking at his bumper, went in way too hard. Luckily we got a bigger gap behind us now. I need to back it down a little bit. I'm getting in too hot and that's getting it sideways. Need to be careful. I need to move the brakes forward if it's just going to jump sideways on entry. I just need to slow down quicker for the corners, though. I have such a bad habit of overdriving. Just slightly. Now we got a big gap to make up, and I'm not sure we're quick enough to do it. But if they get to battling again, we might be able to close back in. Not feeling too fast right now. Still green though, which is good. It's looking like we can stay green. We were pretty spread out. At least the back half of the field is. These guys are all on top of each other still, but even with the contact, they've kept it straight. Got some smoke in three and four there, but don't see a car. I am loose. Just kind of throw it in, let it drift up so it's on the right front more than the right rear with how much this thing wants to slide around. We are closing back in a little bit. Nice gap behind us. But if we're not careful, we're going to be self-spinning. I just keep losing the rear end on entry. Which is not helping. Losing us time. Costing our tires a lot of heat every time we do that. Six. Almost looked like he wanted to peek underneath Riley. Try and set up a pass, but didn't quite get the run out of the corner. It doesn't seem like anybody can really do much right now. I can barely hang on to this gosh dang car. <laughs> Got some lap traffic coming up. That might make things interesting. We'll see. We got a huge gap behind us. Nothing to worry about. And luckily, like I said earlier, if we get a caution, we'll restart on the inside. So we should be able to keep from losing some spots on a restart. Leader gets by the lap car with no trouble. Now he's going to stay high for everyone else. Much appreciated. I slide up, nearly get into him a little bit, but we clear him in time. I was having to chase the car up the track. How loose this thing is. Saw everybody else dragging the wall. I thought it might be fun to try. One car was sliding on entry there a little bit. That's going to give Riley a look again. Maybe a little contact there that sends the one up the track. And I guess the six by him as well. We'll see if the one tries to cross him over. We are nowhere near close enough to do anything. He's trying to make that pass back on the inside. See if he gets that to work. Looks like he is, that outside here. Pretty tough. I'm gonna try and get around 
the STP car out of the corner. We do, no problem. Closing in on halfway. It's going to be interesting to see how these guys go handling-wise. Doesn't seem like they've struggled really at all. We're just now starting to see a little looseness out of them. Six car got a bit wig wiggly there. I feel like I've been struggling the whole time, and we're going to smack the wall. feel like starting to cool the tires back off a little bit, though. We're feeling a bit more gripped up. Unless I do that. That was a bad corner again. I just keep having bad corners in a row. I gotta stop missing that bottom. It's costing us so much time. The car looks fine. No damage to report. These guys aren't making that many mistakes, and I just keep making them. That's why we're losing so much. That felt all right. This is tough. This is a tough track to run a lot of green laps consecutively. It is such a difficult track. Okay, six washed up there a little bit. It's going to give us an opportunity to make up a little bit of ground, but I don't think we did. And I missed the bottom again, but we get it turned down a bit without it getting too loose. Two car maintaining the gap a little bit. The one and the four, Riley. Back nose to tail. All right, we're halfway to the Just now to halfway. Can I get anything to happen? We probably need a caution to have a chance, but I don't think we're quicker than any of these guys up ahead of us. The way it looks right now. One car going for a pass. They're side by side. And he clears them out of two. He's going to go back down low to try and get that to work. They're going to make some more contact. Just going to slow him down a bit. Nothing changes on the running order, and I'm going to continue grabbing that wall until we get faster. Make the car narrower and narrower, maybe we'll gain some speed. <laughs> now they're back to single file, and we're probably back to losing time. Where am I losing all this time? We got five seconds behind us. You try and get back on throttle a little bit sooner without it getting loose or pushing. And we keep missing the bottom, which isn't helping things. Got the 20 to go. I definitely feel like moving the brakes forward a bit would have been very helpful. The way this car feels right now. Riley completes the pass on the entry to three, and the one's going to try and cross him over into one. He's going to slide up and hit him. They're going to be door banging out of turn two there. They're side by side still, going down the back stretch. Been a lot of contact with that battle, but they're keeping it going. Even as they slam into each other, race side by side, we are not catching them hardly at all.
but I feel like I'm doing a little bit better. One car a little bit loose on the bottom. They were starting to close in a little bit as they're still side by side. And I'm on that white line getting it sideways. Had to lift a bit. We're a bit closer than we were a couple laps ago, so that's good. It's about to be a four car race. We're going to catch the back of the six here. They're making any contact where there's an incident. We've got plenty of time to hit the brakes and miss it without fear of getting run over. I gotta keep that in mind. Huge gap behind us. So if we have to really dodge, not gonna have to worry about what's in the mirror, about which direction we pick. Hopefully our reaction time's gonna be good enough if there is something. I don't know if there's going to be anything. Six cars trying to make, take a look there. As they're still side by side, just running about the exact same speed as each other, not able to make up any ground. I'm loose again. Every time we get close to anybody, we start spinning out. They're still side by side. Coming to get 10 to go next time. Let's make sure we don't run into the back of the six. That'll just wreck him for no reason. Don't want to do that. He's being held up right now. 10 to go with the line. Two car just marching away with this thing as we continue to have a very, very intense battle right here. And there's really nowhere I can go right now. It's kind of waiting for something to happen with these two. Or if the six gets involved. They have been side by side for like the last eight laps. A oh, big loose moment there, nearly ate the wall. Really having to wheel this thing out of the corner to keep it straight. Oh, you almost had him cleared there on the inside, but Riley got that run out of the corner on the outside. They're still going to be dead even with each other coming to the line. This is an insane race. <laughs> this is one heck of a race. Six car could almost look three wide if he wanted to. Would be a bad idea most likely, but... He's just sitting here waiting. Nowhere to go. Well, He's almost pulled ahead of him, just barely. We got five to go. They are really, really tight out of the corner, right next to each other. One car's loose on entry like we were. Six car looking low. They're hooking each other. Four car. Riley had to get out of it. Got one outside. Still oh, there. my gosh. Stay low. Six car gets his way through there. Still there. One car Keep clears himself across our nose. 
Now we have to wait on him. Oh my goodness. There's that three wide I was talking about. Okay. Everyone's just going to clear themselves, I guess. One car's gonna block. White Coming to the white. To Six cards ate the wall. Outside. Still there. Stay low. There's a call. Can we get a run here? All clear, all clear. Mad respect, Rocky. That was freaking awesome. And we sneak away with a fourth. Probably yeah, didn't deserve it. We could have maybe snuck away with another Dude, spot I there. I thought we were dead. But, but uh, no good they kept clearing us, clearing themselves across our nose on entry, and we just had to back out of it. I wasn't going to try and just drive through them and wreck everybody, cause a yellow. We come away with a fourth, zero X. And that was freaking intense. Freaking intense. Really unlucky there for the six. Uh, he probably deserved more than that. He was faster than both of them there for a long time. He just couldn't go anywhere because they were too wide in front of him. And then he kind of got shuffled out of line and got the wall out of four coming to the white. And that got us around him. But man, what a race that was. That was intense. Didn't expect it to be like that. I figured it'd be a couple cautions and we'd get spread out after that but uh, that was intense racing the whole way and we go green pretty awesome five gets a big run out of two behind the ten gets into the back of the ten a little bit I don't think the five meant to do that I think he just got out of the corner a bit quicker than he expected five car again here it's gonna be pushing up grabbing that wall we did that a couple times and uh, this is coming to the white flag. Just This is the only other thing that really happened. The six car grabs the wall there. He actually leaves us a lane instead of, like the other two did, just going across our nose and hoping we'd lift. But uh, the six definitely deserved to beat us there. He was quicker the whole time. But he gets shuffled out three wide, and then grabs the wall, and we come away and steal it from him and get a 0x. P4. And uh, that was some intense, intense battling. But yeah, no big deal there. Just hard racing. But Could have could have been dangerous, especially if you know someone's not going to lift or don't know if someone's going to lift. Could have easily gotten wrecked. But we played it safe, and we come away with a top five, just like I wanted. And we get to see a crazy, intense battle and get involved there a little bit and uh, do it all cleanly. So pretty cool.